What's up guys, this is Riley from Hotson Motors. Today is May 16th. We just ended our first gen Cummins giveaway last night. We're gonna show you guys a, a quick walk around of our next giveaway truck, our 83 Ford F350. If you're just stumbling upon this video and don't know what I'm talking about by giveaways, here at Hotson Motors, we build and collect and buy and put together cool old classic trucks and then we give them away through our website, hotsonmotors.com, where you go on, you buy stuff and for every $5 you spend, you get one entry into winning one of these trucks. So that's the purpose of today's video is we're gonna show you what our next giveaway truck is. We're also gonna be loading up our 83 Chevy Suburban. It's a come and swap Suburban, very cool truck. And we're taking that down to paint, picking up our next giveaway truck, the 83 Ford and doing a little swap there. So we'll show you guys uh, the truck that we just finished wrapping up on the giveaway. We'll show you that truck real quick, show you the Suburban, get it loaded up on the tow truck and head out to the paint store. So uh, let's go take a look. This is our tow truck, uh, 73 2000 F450. Uh, this thing was a steal on eBay and I love this truck and it is like literally the backbone of our business. I could not do any of this if it wasn't for the rollback. It's a Hodges rollback bed, really nice. And just works great and it's a little private tow truck and, and it just allows us to do all this kind of stuff. So it's really nice. All right, so here is the truck that we just finished the giveaway on last night. The entries ended last night at midnight and then all this week we'll ship out the rest of the orders. We'll count up all the entries. We'll get everything organized and ready to go. And then on Friday, we'll pick a winner live here on YouTube, on our YouTube live. So that's going away. This was the best and the biggest and the baddest truck we've ever given away. And uh, it was really good and people loved it and we're super excited to see who wins this truck. But it was a rad truck, six speed manual conversion, 12 valve Cummins, crew cab, you can't beat it. 35 inch tires, rad, rad, rad truck that we posted a lot about. If you're seeing this video, it's too late to enter in to win that truck, but we're gonna always be giving away cool stuff like that. So I'll show you the Suburban and let's get her loaded up. This is our 83 Cummins and Swap Suburban. I'll put a link down in the description of the full walk around of the condition in which we bought this truck and all the things that we're gonna do to it. But we have let you guys, by participating in the first gen Cummins giveaway, you got votes as to how we're gonna build this. So this truck is getting painted in a sand color. We're gonna do a cool roof rack and different wheels and tires and black trim and all that kind of stuff. This giveaway won't happen until, you know, maybe September or October of this year. So with that being said, we need to go take it to paint now and have it painted in that sand color. That was the color that you guys decided on. We've got it all disassembled, tail lights, everything's off, door handles. It's all ready to get scuffed up and reshot in its new sand color. This truck's rad. Very, very, very cool truck. Runs and drives great. Four speed auto, 12 valve Cummins on 37, staying a 60 front end. Just a rad truck. Watch that video if you want to know more about it in its current state. So we're gonna go ahead and start it up, put it on the rollback, and uh, go down to the paint shop. Telling you, having a tow truck is, you can't beat it. You just gotta go somewhere and drive right up, done. Strap it down, out of here. Am I far enough forward? We're perfect. We are driving the tow truck, got the Suburban on the back. We're going down to uh, NV Auto Body, my buddy Jorge's shop. And uh, he's painted up the bull nose for us. Looks really good. Nice uh, bright red on, on Oxford white two-tone paint job, uh, which I'm excited about. This will be, I think, our first two-tone truck that we've given away, like true two-tone like that. So it's gonna be pretty cool. But we're on our way now to, over to his and uh, we'll drop off the Suburban. He's gonna paint this up for us and then we'll pick up the bull nose and head back to the shop and give you guys the full, the full breakdown. We're 
gonna unload her off the tow truck and then we'll go over it real quickly. Just show you some of the details. Uh, paint job looks great. Little touch-ups that the painter's gonna come back and clean up some of the pinstriping, but overall, the paint job looks really nice. Body looks nice and straight. So let's let her down and then we'll go over some of the fun things that we've got coming up on this bad boy. Okay, we have made it back to the shop. We are dirty, we are sweaty, we are tired. It's hot. It went from being beautiful in Las Vegas like three days ago to being 100 degrees just overnight. So, you know, it is what it is. We gotta get acclimated to it. So here we are here tow trucking and working on them out in the sun and just, you know, we'll get used to it or we won't and just we'll just sweat like crazy. It is what it is. However, the bull nose looks great. There's a few little areas that need touched up. The painter's gonna come back out, do a little pinstriping just to clean up some of the white and the pinstriping. But besides that, the body is nice and straight. It looks really good. It's gonna make for one excellent, excellent giveaway truck. Uh, we're a little kind of nervous about this one only because, you know, this is a single cab dually. This is a different giveaway than anything we've ever done. We've never done a single cab long bed dually, but hopefully you guys can appreciate that it's it's cool, it's different, it's a classic, but it's still workable and it's pretty red. This truck was originally beige on brown from the factory, was repainted once upon a time red on white. When I first posted pictures of it on our Instagram, everyone was like, hey, you better keep that thing red on white. So sure enough, we did. Just made it look really, really, really nice. Uh, this is going to be like an OEM plus build, so still chrome bumpers and chrome grill. But we're going to go up to 35 inch tires. We've got some 35 inch Milestar uh, MT02s over there uh, on 16 inch wheels. So we're going to keep the stock 16s and run 35s on 16s. It's going to look really cool. You know, it might rub a little, but dude, it's going to look so freaking rad that who cares? We have a, a Skies Off Road Design Shackle Reversal Kit that we're going to use to convert this truck from two wheel drive to four wheel drive. So that's going to, we're going to get rid of the whole twin I beam front suspension and go to a leaf spring front end with a solid front axle out of an F350. Got a Dana 60 out of like an OBS, a 95, 92 to 97 Ford F350 front axle that we've got disc brake front axle and everything. Super nice. Those axles are worth freaking money. And we just luckily had one out of a wreck chassis that we had and it was like, perfect, let's use it. So we've got that front axle and we'll use that and it will look really, really, really nice. The truck is pretty dirty. So, I mean, you, you kind of get the picture here but it's been down at the paint and body shop and if you guys ever had a truck paint, it tends to be pretty filthy. So we need to wash it. We'll give it a good bath later this week and really get ready for it. But we got super duty seats in this bad boy. Interior will be really nice, all blacked out interior. We've got some gauges coming from a, a company we've never worked with, but, but we're stoked to work with them. It's called New Vintage Designs and they are a, a really cool gauge cluster company that sells gauges for trucks like this. And we're really pumped about using them and trying them out on this build. This is a 6.9 International IDI indirect injection diesel engine. So 6.9 IDI is what these are commonly referred to. These were good torquey little engines, but they were non-turbo. They were naturally aspirated back in the 80s. And we are going to put on here a Banks Sidewinder turbo system. So the whole entire bank system, full downpipe and exhaust, everything. So this thing makes boost. And they claim that it literally cuts the 060 time in half for these trucks. So really cool. We're excited about the bank system that we're going to be able to put on this as well. It's going to make it actually pretty dang drivable. Truck has air conditioning already, so we'll just, you know, keep its factory AC. If you guys have ever driven a bullnose, they actually have pretty dang good AC from the factory, so we'll keep that as well. Uh, we'll do new grill, new bumpers, and all that kind of stuff as well. And bumper guards make it look like a really nice ranch truck, and we call it the Rancher. Another thing we're really excited about on this truck is uh, we're gonna get rid of the four-speed manual transmission. This has a T15 four-speed manual, and uh, that's a granny gear three-speed, so fourth gear in this is one-to-one -one gear ratio, which means you're pretty much topped out at 60 miles an hour. And that means you're pretty revved out at 60 miles an hour. So we're gonna get rid of that. And we actually have a ZF5 five-speed manual transmission, which is an overdrive five-speed manual. Those are a, a almost direct bolt-in. All you gotta do is change out the clutch and boom, you can run a, a ZF5 behind me. So we have a ZF5 manual transmission with the transfer case included as well. That will just be able to bolt right up and make this thing four-wheel drive. And you're gonna have a really cool 6.9, but still ZF5. It's gonna be a different, really cool truck. 6.9 sounds great. So to be able to keep the 6.9, and still run the five-speed manual is gonna be a really big plus. All right, back here, you can obviously tell there's no tailgate. Reproduction tailgates for these trucks are absolutely garbage. And we just found a complete crew cab bull nose that we're not gonna use the bed off of and its tailgate was in great shape. So we didn't have it in time for this to go get painted, but we pulled off that tailgate off the crew cab and ran that down to paint when we picked this up. So we'll have the tailgate to match later on. It'll be just fine, but it's gonna look really rad. All right, the interior's filthy, so don't judge it by this, but we just wanted to do this quick video so you guys can see the truck and get excited as we build it and get ready for our next year. Interior's filthy, but it is gonna be pretty nice. Super duty uh, seats in here, so I have like a 99 to 03 Ford F250 interior in this truck. Fits in great and is a little more comfortable than the old school seats. So 
that'll be nice as well just to keep those and clean them up and make them look good. But the dash pad and everything else is in great shape. We'll get rid of that 90s ugly radio and go to a classic uh, retro sound radio to to go in there as well. But we'll keep this factory steering column, maybe do an upgraded steering wheel or something like that. And then plus those new gauges and this thing will look like pretty stinking nice on the inside. Be a good work truck, but also something you can take to a car show and, and just enjoy. All right guys, so that's pretty much it. That's the whole game plan for this truck. We're really pumped about it. It's a different giveaway than what we've done in the past, which makes me nervous because I don't know how it's gonna go, but I hope you guys love it. And I hope that you guys can enjoy the process as we put it together. We'll post more videos of us doing the front axle swap and the ZF5 swap. And we'll just kind of keep up with this vlog style during this build process. But we wanted, you know, this was a, a quick and dirty video, but we thought you guys would enjoy to see kind of really what it's like. Not so polished and put together and everything. This is just life, you know, tow trucking and getting dirty and sweating our balls off. And it is what it is. So we hope you enjoy the truck. We hope you get excited about it. It's gonna make somebody really happy. It'd be a perfect work truck, ranch truck, or just cruising and taking to car shows and doing all that kind of stuff. Who doesn't love a big fat booty Judy freaking dually? You know, they look rad. So. That's it for today's video. Check us out on Instagram at Hudson Motors and Facebook as well to see more updates on this truck as we build it. I will post a lot on our stories on Instagram and Facebook. We'll post constantly there and then every couple of weeks we'll post here on YouTube. Check us out on our website, HudsonMotors.com. When this, when we're done with the truck is when we will announce when the giveaway will go live. This might be in about a month from now. In about a month, watch out on our website, HudsonMotors.com as we uh, as we finish this thing up and get it ready to go. We'll do cool bullnose inspired merch and all that kind of stuff, keychains and all the goodies to, to to really kick this one off. So thanks for watching guys. I hope you appreciate it. Hope you like the bullnose and don't forget to check us out on Instagram and Facebook. Thanks guys. Have a good one.